We're going to head to later today when Attorney General William Barr is set to release a redacted version of the Mueller report. It's been two years since the special counsel began his investigation into the Russian meddling into the 2016 election. The Attorney General is set to hold a news conference before releasing that final report. Alexander Leslie tracking the latest live in the newsroom. Well, shortly after that press conference, the report will be delivered to Congress on CDs. Then it will be made public on the special counsel's website, but we won't be able to see all of it. Grand jury material and other classified information has been redacted by Attorney General William Barr. As we've reported, Barr released a four-page summary of the report last month. In it, he says Robert Mueller found no evidence of collusion and made no determination on whether the president has obstructed justice. Barr determined Mr. Trump had not. Attorney General Barr will speak to the press at 9.30 this morning. It's just about an hour before the final 400-page report is expected to be delivered to Capitol Hill. But the timing of this conference has some concern. House Judiciary Chairman Jerry Nadler says Barr is covering for President Trump and will likely spin the, president, or the report's findings. Speaking to a D.C. morning radio show yesterday, the president said he was confident ahead of the report's release. Barr is not allowing the facts of the Mueller report to speak for themselves but is trying to bake in the narrative about the report to the benefit of the White House. This should never happen to a president or to this country again, uh, what took place. And you'll see a lot of uh, very strong things come out tomorrow. Meanwhile, President Trump says he may also hold a press conference after the report is released this morning. Reporting live from the newsroom, I'm Alexandra Leslie, Eyewitness News.